the closest to perfect. You have everything you need. You're the closest to a K-pop artist. You have such a strong voice. When you dance, it's, it's just like magic. I think you can be a star. So I'll see you in LA. Every time I start a new audition show, the thing that keeps me up at night is the worry about not having good talents. But more than I want it, it's more than I need. So I think now we can do this. I think we're gonna have a great group out of these kids. Seeing something from this with my name on it helped make it more real. Wow, this is like actually happening. <laughs> oh my god, this is so real. It still hasn't hit me yet, actually. I'm, it's still processing in my brain at the moment. But I know this is what I want, so like, you know, I'm getting what I want, like what I worked for. And so, yeah, I was excited, really excited. I'm really nervous um, because I'm the youngest. Hello everyone! Hi. Welcome to the City of Angels. Through this boot camp, we will select the final candidates who goes to Korea. Select the final candidates who goes to Korea. And the evaluation will be given to you using this A2K necklace, which has four empty slots for you to fill. If you fill all four slots with four different stones, then you become the final candidate to go to Korea. Each stone represents four different competency, dancing in vocals, star quality, and your character. Singing, dancing, and star quality would be an individual mission. That was amazing! You are not this good. What happened to you? You're forcing me to select you. That's a standing ovation. That. Regarding the character evaluation, there won't be any performance for it. But instead, the feedbacks and the opinions that we collect from the trainers and the staff and fellow talents will decide their grade. That's it. Every movement, very surprising. <laughs> it's so good. Regarding the stones, there's three ways to receive it. First, right after your performance, when I feel like the performance was competent enough, I'll give the stone right away as soon as you finish the performance. Second, after the evaluation, there will be an evaluation meeting between me and the staff to decide if there's any more contestants who deserve to receive the stones. And third, so you can actually receive all four stones at the final mission if you show me your improvement. And before we start the boot camp, there's one thing I need you to remember. The number of the final candidates that go to Korea is not fixed. All of you can become the final candidate and all of you can make the group. You don't have to compete with each other. You can help each other. You can win together. So I think this is a big chance for me to debut and I really want to survive until the last round. I want to put in any work that I can do to get it. I'm going to have confidence from here on, so I do believe it. I want to put forward the best in me.
So we start with the dance evaluation. Dance evaluation, speed, power, and accuracy is a given. But what I'll be looking for on top of that is the ability to infuse emotions into those movements. And before we start, let me give you an important tip. The most important thing that you should think about when you're dancing to get a great evaluation is to enjoy it. I'm pretty sure you guys enjoy dancing, right? Just if you can take away the evaluation part from your head and enjoy while you're dancing, I'm pretty sure you'll get a great evaluation, okay? All right, from Florida. <laughs> from Florida. <laughs> Savannah. Hi. Hello, so how do you spend your time since the audition? I've been very busy because I'm also like a captain for my school's dance team. I've been doing that after school for like two hours and then I work after that. Yeah, and then practicing a lot too on my own time and yeah. So you remember what I told you, right? Yes. yes. <laughs> You look less prepared than other contestants. You look less prepared than other contestants. You know, I was upset after the regionals, like, you know, because that wasn't actually the case. It just happened to, you know, look that way. And I'm kind of mad that that's the impression that he has because, like, that's not true. Yeah, that is a little frustrating because that's all he's really, I feel like he's seeing right now. That's still kind of bumming me out. Really hot. I want him to see that like I am dedicated and just look at my dancing. It was somewhat strategic, yeah. I feel like that one just showed the most like me. Um, I chose that one because I thought it showed a lot of my past, like in gymnastics too. Just the choreo showed a lot of that, like the leg lift and the twist off the floor, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> well, um, well, starting off, you know, I made sure I was prepared this time enough. I'm hoping to get like feedback where it's like not you know, related to dedication. So, all right, so let me see you dance.
That's a leader of a dance team. That's a leader of a dance team. Like, I can put you up on stage with MX right now. Like, that's how great you were. That's how great you were. Thank you. You were fast and strong and powerful in the movements that needed accent, but at the same time, you were relaxed and loose enough to not go ahead of the beat and just flow with the music. And then, because of your background in gymnastics, the way you can control your body, it's amazing, especially when you hold their leg that long at the top of the song and how you flipped your body, extending your leg, like those things, that's your advantage because you were trained to do those things through gymnastics. Thank you. That was amazing, come here. That was amazing, come here. I need, I'm expecting more from you, right? A little bit more dedication, right? Just focus, you, you can be so good, all right? Thank you. Okay. I was happy with the feedback that he gave. So, yeah, on to the next one. Tomorrow, hopefully, <laughs> yeah. All right, next, I'll... Okay, next, Camila. Okay, next, Camila. Hi. Since both of your parents are Cuban and you're fluent in Spanish, right? Yeah. It'll be great to have a Latin member in the group and knowing <laughs> yeah. you'll be able to communicate with all those Latino fans out there. So what was the reaction from your friends and family when they found out you passed the regional audition? Amazing. So yeah, they were super excited. I'm so nervous. No, I'm like really, really, really nervous. What are you doing? I see. You look like a dancer. I'm not. He literally criticized my dancing. And he said it was, it was too slow. Slow? Yeah. It's like I'm seeing the whole dalla dalla in slow motion. You're dancing everything in a very smooth feel. And that's not gonna work. Some movement has to be so powerful and fast. I can't find those movements at all. I don't know if you can do it though. After my audition, I've been working on that so hard. Seven choreographies for the past month. I made sure to really practice dancing like every single day. Like focus on the details, being fast, exactly what JYP told me. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to do better this time and I'm gonna work hard and fix everything that he said. And I just wanted him to at least like tell me, oh, you've improved and I'm glad that you worked on what I said. All right, so let's go. Let's go. You have to be like the best. Yo.
that was kind of perfect to me too. Like, <laughs> that was so good. And so I was like, oh my God. Whatever, like all the things that he told me, I made sure to fix that. I made sure that it was perfect, that it was fast. Every movement shouldn't be done at the same speed and power. There's certain movements that you just have to put an accent to it. And then the other movements should be relaxed and cool. You were doing both back and forth. You were doing both back and forth. You kept all the good things about your performance and improved on the things that you were lacking. Thank you. Now I see accent among your movements. Faster and stronger. And you, you definitely got the vibe inside your dance, which I really love. I just can feel how much time and effort you put in in your preparation for this boot camp. I'm so proud of you. Come here. Come here. Thank you. But there still can be more improvement, all right? Yes, for sure. <laughs> the accent can be more stronger, more faster, but you're definitely on the right track. Thank you I'm so, so much. proud of you. Thank Here's you. Here's your first stone. Congratulations. When I received the stone, I was very, very <laughs> surprised because my dancing was the, not my strongest. So I was like very worried about that. I can I couldn't believe it. I was so happy. All right, next, call you with a different name from what's written here, Lexi. Your sense of balance is so good, that's why you can control your body. If you just let yourself be loose, you're gonna grow so fast. Ballet major Lexi, how much control she had over her body, but at the same time, she has the bounce and the groove that classically trained talents rarely have. I mean, I'm really looking forward to her dance. So what were you focusing on most while you're preparing for the boot camp? Uh, regarding your advice, I really tried to, since the song that I decided to do was more of a grounded dance and a different kind of vibe from the one that I had showed you at regionals. Um, overall, since regionals, it was a little bit stressful and I want to better myself, so. So I chose God's Menu by Stray Kids. I decided to choose that song because definitely very like masculine and um, hard hitting. So um, I wanted to show a different side of me. When there are things that I want to present to him, um, rather than just copying what's straight off of the video. I think still adding in your own elements, like being yourself, because I think in the industry that being yourself is a really big thing, so. I try to focus on differentiating myself from my ballet side. All right, so show me a dance.
쳐 리지 말고 와 비벼 비벼 네 손님 Okay, Lexi, where did this hip hop swag come from suddenly? Like, out of nowhere, what, what happened to you? <coughs> I've been doing hip hop for a few years, but I tried to study the energy of the dance as well. You look like a different person. You look like a different person. Like I told you in the regional audition, you know how to control every tip of your body. It was just that I didn't have that swag, that energy, that spice. And suddenly you come up with this, this, the dynamic was crazy. The up and down, the ebbs and flow, it was crazy. I didn't know you have it in you. Such an amazing improvement. Come here. That was amazing. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank I'm not that generous with my stones. Wow, you guys are making me look so generous and making this boot camp look too easy. I think when he said that, I was able to change that so quickly. It made me happy because I do feel that my hard work has paid off in that performance. But yeah, I'm very happy. the quality that we need to see. Just like give it my all. I want to put forward the best in me. Top of the top level. The worst among all contestants today. 